Christmas is all around me. Hello and welcome to Baking Mess. Today I will be baking with you, as traditionally I do every year, some Christmas cookies. My name is Jana, you're watching Curves on the Road and let's do some Christmas baking. We will be making short crust cookies. They are very, very popular in Czech Republic. They are called Linetské cukroví, in case you want to order it here in a bakery. And it's basically two thin layers of pastry. And in the middle, there's a jam, marmalade, something sweet to stick it together. We will not do that precisely, but we will decorate them generously. And since you're watching a travel channel, you probably guessed what the decorations will look like. So are you excited like me? Let's do it. This recipe is sometimes called grandma's recipe and it has to be followed strictly. You will need flour, you will need butter, you will need sugar and you won't need eggs. Actually, you might need two yolks. Well, they're already crushed, so one step ahead. A little extra tip from the professional bakers. When you go to the supermarket for the ingredients, and if you're lucky, look for an ingredient that looks like this. Let me get you a close up. And from the other side, And those of you who learned that Linetské těsto means short crust pastry know that this is the holy grail. This is already made. This is what we will be going for if we're be mixing the sugar and butter and all that jazz. So if you don't have time for that shit, you just buy it for yourself. Now that we have flour, we will roll the dough. We don't actually even have the good rolling pin, you know, the two hand one. We only have uh, this thing. So, you know, we have good men in this household because we are not waiting with them at 3 a.m. with this. It wouldn't be threatening whatsoever. Let's see if it works at least for the dough. The dough smells by lemon zest. I don't like lemon zest at all. That's the downside when you're cheating and you're buying yourself the dough in the already made because, well, you'll get what you bought. But, I mean, it is what it is, right? It will serve its purpose. Normal people make short crust circles. It's even called Linetská kolečka, which means Linetská circles in Czech. So we will be original. We will be doing short crust rectangles. I know it's not very like innovative in the UK. They do it in this shape, but like it has a purpose. So bear with me. I have a torturing device normally for pizza, but it'll be ideal to cut the pastry. If you are now saying she's cheating, it's already done. Well, of course, do you think I know how to do this? It's my dad who actually pre-cut it for me because like, I can't make a straight line, can you? And I'm even messing it up. I think I'll stop and it's perfectly done. Ta-da! I'll use this shot glass the wrong way or the way I usually don't use shot glass and I'll make a hole in one. Stay with me for what it's gonna be for. Thank you. 
In the time I managed to move the dough on the tray, a good TikToker can cook the whole dinner. And now it's oven time. Let's bake. We will bake on 180 degrees for 10 minutes. As you can see, this is an inclusive plate. There are some whites, there are some browns. Let's get some blue. We have the white of the egg mixed with a lot of sugar. So we have white if we need white. And here we will mix it with the blue color. I hope some of you have recognized a flag. Those of you from Europe, you have probably even recognized that the flag is of the Czech Republic. Yes, this is our Czech flag. And this one, Red Cross, not Switzerland, no. Does it still look like Switzerland? Not anymore, right? Correct, it's a Union Jack. I'll have some video for you, actually from Scotland, but the Union Jack just looks better. And how could I forget my favorite and quite difficult to make actually flag of Brazil. Before you ask, no, I didn't write the slogan there. This one is the only one done from the two layers with marmalade in between because it simply worked and it's supposed to be Japan. And the last, but definitely not least, is the flag of the United States of America. When I arrived there after four years, I realized I really miss the country and I want to go back. Please ignore that I use snowflakes instead of stars. So here is the final product. For the people whose country's flags I tried to create here, please don't feel offended. I mean, I even did my country's and I'm highly offended, but please don't take it lightly. Uh, I'm, I think you might have noticed I'm not an expert on decorating the Christmas cookies. This was more about symbolic because like, all those flags represent the countries that I'll be visiting in the upcoming year and you will consequently have some videos, some content from there. So I hope you enjoyed somebody messing up more than you ever would by decorating a cookie. If you have any tips how to make a better icing, please let me know down in comments. If you tried and failed like me, that would be lovely to hear from you because like, I feel like I'm the worst baker ever, but it was actually fun to do. It's a little bit like the painting by numbers, but I know that I probably should have chosen different icing because this one more, was more for the details and I needed like more of the surfaces. So next time I'll try probably something else if there's ever next time. Like now after finishing it, I think there'll be never any, any next time for this, but who knows in a year, 
at the Christmas time we might meet again. So that's it. That's the whole video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why don't you give me one icing thumb up and you can subscribe to my channel. I upload every Sunday. Thank you very much for watching. Have an amazing rest of your day and bye.